Hello everyone, welcome to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So this time I am going to show you how to create a landscape material which blends its layers based on the height of the landscape. So as you can see in this example, I have this in the top part is covered with the material I created which blends its layers according to the slope of the ground and the lower part is covered with the material layer based on its height so this is how it works so here I have this height parameter and as I change it you can see in this uh, word that layer goes up and down and also I can change the sharpness of the blending with this parameter as well so I'm going to show you how to implement this. Okay, let's get started. So this is my current material. I'll open it here and this one. Okay, so we have these uh, other elements which blends the material based on the slope. So I'll forget this part for now and I'll create another layer like this which represent the shoreline or the beach or the sand. I'll just call it L4 color. Okay and uh, I'll change its color to something like white. which represents sand okay so now I need a way to access the height of the landscape point so we can do that with absolute world this world position node and here I can change this one I will actually this default selection would work so then what I have to do is I have to get the height that means we don't need the XY parameters of the position we only need the height of the ground so we can get that with a mask and I can mask B channel here right now I'm going to define I'm going to define the height of the landscape which happens this layer blending so I will promote this to a parameter and call it blend height right and I leave it as 0 for now and now I'm going to divide this uh, so that I can get a gradient of the difference that we can get from these two parameters so that represent the gradient of the layer change so I'll promote this to another parameter and call it height blend sharpness and I'll leave this as one so now I'll clamp this one between one and zero because uh, when we blend layers it should be in between one and zero right now I'll duplicate this part this I'll create another one print material attributes node and as the alpha I'll connect this one and as the V layer I'll connect this one 
and as the A layer I'll connect whatever we had before for the auto layer all right and I'll connect this one into the layer auto all right so that's all I have to do and I'll apply this so as you can see we have this clear blending of layer between this uh, layer 4 and the auto layer here so I'll go to my material instance and see what happens there okay so we have that gun also here right now let's see what happened in our landscape so the shaders are compiling let's wait until they are done okay shaders are compiled but still we don't see the layer 4 that's because this uh, this blend height is at 0 and maybe our landscape is above 0 on all the places we can check it like this if I drag and drop a cube like here cube here and check the Z position of this uh, as I suspected it is in the hundred so that means this landscape is above hundred all over the place so I'll make it like hundred and ten okay so we got this right now we got this uh, beach layer as I would like to call it like this so uh, and let's uh, I uh, try change in the height blending sharpness like this yes that's too much and there is right now we, we get this a smooth blending between these two layers and that's all I want to show you guys for today and all right so see you in the next episode in the next episode i think i will show you how to texture the landscape okay see you in the next video goodbye